So, Jariel, you know, it's two weeks before decision meetings, right? So I'm going to invite your mom and you to come in so I can let her know about your college application process, your acceptances, but more importantly, what your financial packages will look like for these colleges. So I know you haven't received any yet, but I'm hoping by the spring break, you'll have a few that we can analyze. I also think though, in the meantime, you can fill out some scholarship applications. That would be really beneficial, just in case, you know, the packages aren't as strong. I'm glad you have some state schools that you're considering, but sometimes there is gaps that might be a little bit difficult. You've talked with your mom about money for college. She's very comfortable for it. Like she wants, she wants me to uh, just chase whatever I have, like what dreams do I have. She knows I'm into marketing, so um, she's very heavy into it. So this may be really helpful, Jariel, as yeah. we're thinking about your colleges and some of the major differences between your top three choices. You mentioned classroom sizes, so out of all of them, Framingham has the smallest. So you see that here indicates the ratio is 11 to 1. This is the direct cost, right? So we're thinking about tuition and fees. It looks like even Framingham State would be the lowest as well yeah. when it comes to cost. So, you know, if you're thinking about adding financial aid, so like grants and scholarships that you'll get from the schools, this will be even lower. 